Um, hi everybody, for those who don't know my name, my name is Melva Lorenzo. I'm currently a fourth year mechanic on aerospace engineer. Um, so let's see, I got involved with Calais, uh, I think starting uh, winter quarter of second year, and I actually helped out with uh, a little bit of the planning for the uh, banquet. And that's how I ended up getting involved, and actually that's how I think Eduardo got involved too. We are both working on that, and uh, I think that was awesome. So um, after my second year, I, uh, or not after, oh, when nominations came by, I really like LS and I really like the people there. And I decided to run for uh, communications. Uh, something I've never said in uh, public is, uh, I have cancer. And uh, it was really hard for me to deal with that, but uh, I feel like, the people from uh, people from Calais uh, were really my backbone in continuing my education, and they were there for moral support, academic support, and I think they were more of a family to me. Sorry, I've never said that in public. <laughs> um, so, third year I was a communications major, but I felt really bad because of, just because of everything that was going on. And I really, really got back to give back to everybody that was helping me. Fourth year came along and I decided to withdraw from the nominations because I thought it would be a repeat of uh, my third year, but <clears throat> I'm now fourth year, and thanks to Kales and everybody that supported me, I'm still in school, and I'm still on track to get my uh, mechanical and aerospace degrees, so thanks to everybody. Um, <laughs> Like as a person starting my second year when I joined Calais, I definitely changed. Uh, maybe not too noticeably, but I noticed a change. And that wouldn't have happened without this continuous support from everybody. And uh, this year for me it was kind of hard because it's like kind of, I saw like whole new faces. So it was really hard for me to kind of um, get to know everybody. But uh, um, I feel great. And I feel very optimistic, I think that's the word, for my future. And thanks to everybody here and every past member, and actually two people are here from that. Um, without you guys, I would be nowhere. And uh, I recently went to MLA, and I think that really helped me develop the kind of person. That helped me identify things that I need to work on. And it also highlighted some of the key attributes that I think I'm really good at. And I think that will help me. And and I feel what would be me giving back to you guys anything that you guys might need or anything that I needed. Um, I'm more than willing to help anybody here, even if I don't know you or if we're like really good friends. Um, I would almost literally do anything for you guys because uh, without you guys and without this club, I would be no one. And I'm running for these three positions. I think I like VP um, just because uh, I feel like. It's probably not true, but I feel like I would have more of an impact. That's yeah, definitely not true. <laughs> I just want to have an impact on uh, definitely the younger guys, the future kids who are, who are eventually going to take over the club in a few years. I definitely want to get back to you guys, and I want to get back to everybody. Treasurer, I'm really good with money. I like spending money a lot, <laughs> but uh, I'm also really good with money. Um, when I need to be, I'm very responsible, and I know how to take care of money. And I know how to get money, and I know how to get it from people. <laughs> and, uh, university liaison, uh, I think I'm a, uh, I'm really good in business situations. Um, question. <laughs> um, question. I'm really good in uh, meeting people and uh, with a specific need. Like if our club needs anything, I'm really good with that. I think. Actually, I know. Um, and
and anything that this help, this club might need help in, or just like communicating with other clubs on campus and things like that, uh, I really feel confident in. So any of these would be great. Uh, not gonna lie, I'd prefer the BP. I think I've grown and matured enough to where I am not as selfish as I was coming in as a high schooler and things like that. I've learned that it's not just about me, it's everybody in this club. Ultimately, I'm not doing this for me, I'm doing this for everybody here and the future generations for those who are going to be and eventually impact the younger kids before them. So I think it's, a, it's good to leave a really good impression, a big impression, and help set up the future to be sustainable to where Calais can finally start growing again and recruit younger people. Uh, thank you for your time and uh, vote for me.